just has to be done the other way. But uh, the next the next save spot we find, I'm going to save it, and that's going to be the end of it. It is approaching 1.30 in the morning here. I feel like this game is going to be a lot longer than the last two. Oh my god! What? We got that fucking cane. We gotta look out. I'm taking your cigarettes. Taking that cream-filled cake. <laughs> oh, some beer. Yeah, I need that. What are you doing? Come on, you goddamn monster. Do what you always do. Come on. Shut up. Whoops. Swan song. Well, I back your survival. Oh, I got an auto pack. Hope you enjoyed your AARP commercial. Go put the. I'm closer. Oh God. I did. What are you doing? Oh God, I'm gonna get jump scared, aren't I? <laughs> I did. <sighs> you found a hidden I cannot see you, but can perceive you. He won't chase you, and you won't have to hide. When he's near you, be silent, and above all, avoid him. If he comes for you, he'll try to kill you to correct the timeline. Oh. Maybe I can keep this then this time, whatever it is. Bedroom key. Definitely saw it turn into a hit. Oh, there we go. Nice yes, I'll take that. Oh, Jesus. Need to get out of here as soon as possible. Yeah, hello. Got you. Oh! <laughs> I tried, I'm clicking trying to stab him. <laughs> you need that red. I've been trying to no, 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 you already crouched. You're good. You're good. I need to spray sleeping spray sleeping gas so that all the children can be transferred to the hospital for surgery and returned back. It's pretty pretty mean. It's pretty sick, Sean. We're gonna we're gonna go gas all those kids? Yeah. Please, what is Auschwitz? Oh! What's that right there? It's, I think that's Yakov. We yell at him. I don't like Yakov. And then drink a second. Or I can just fucking crush this. <sighs> Whatever anyone thinks. I First chatter to respond gets the answer, I guess. I'm too lazy to set up a fucking hole. Crush it. Alright, Chaos. You got it. <coughs> Not a good start. <coughs> <coughs> The door is locked and without power. I can't see anything through the peephole. My intrusive thought won there. I just had to. Battery was a five. So it's definitely a cipher, but I don't know where we'd be punching that stuff in. If I have to be honest here for a second. I do have another key, though. Could it be? Yep. It's fucking time. Jesus Christ. 
Christ! No! No, no! Up at the school bus. Dude that was whistling up in, uh, in the second floor in the house. What the fuck was that? Are you gonna be a sprinter? I feel like you're a sprinter. Really feel like you're a sprinter. You're a sprinter. Yo, that sprint! Holy shit! <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm in the bush. You can't see me. What the fuck was that? I'm in the dark. I'll even turn the light on for a second. Yeah, it's not building at all. It's dark. I would have lost my shit if that fucking elk was standing right in front of me when I turned the lighter back on. Oh my god, I fucking froze at that. Oh. God. No way. Who's at the door? What do you want? So that's Luca. That's us from the past. And we're like, here, take this letter. Go to the bungalow. We're going. Yeah, this is, I think this is still bugged, which is cool. It's more of a feature than a bug. <laughs> Do we really have to jump scare me research? Okay. That's everything. I unlocked the something or others. I don't know how to get there. I know that's there. Oh! Oh! Can't check, so I'm gonna build keys check. Sorry, everybody. Hope you're all doing well in this uh, pre-Friday or uh, a prelude to the the weekend, which is very much needed, uh, <laughs> to say the least. But anyways, hope you're all doing pretty well. Um, we are going to play uh, a new game tonight. came out 
week or so ago. Uh, Jug stream hype. Oh boy. All these candy rabbit dances super fast. <laughs> um, so we have uh, We Are Not Alone, new game that came out. And our very own Vandra and Diana, uh, I have been told, did some voice acting for this game. So I'm excited to hear my friends' voices in a game. Um, <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> I'm going to have a good stream, my dude. All right, thanks, Knox. Hope you have a good stream, too. My lips keep getting chapped today. All right. Ugh. Um, so, uh... Like I said, very much looking forward to playing this game. It's a new horror game, obviously. That's like, all right, put it on the list. Uh, solo developer? Okay, put it on the list. Friends? Are voice acting in the game? Yeah, put it to the top of the list. So, here we are. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, so, I'm, I'm pretty excited to play this one. Um, I do have to say, I... Um, I spent about an hour of my day today going through, well, not exactly 48, because I already knew people I was going to be voting for anyways. Uh, but I went through probably about 40 different Twitch channels today, looked at if there was a stream trailer, looked at what kind of games they've been playing recently, um, if they knew anybody, um, that I knew, because I could usually look down and see, like, uh, streamers that they recommend, see if I noticed anybody. And then um, went to the About page, looked at the About page, see, if, like, you know, kind of like the branding and whatnot, and then there was three clips per, uh, per application. Uh, and I looked through, you know, looked through all, all those clips. And, uh, yeah, I ended up voting for... Probably less than half of the 48 applicants. Yeah, probably under 24, but definitely over 15. Somewhere in the middle there. Uh, but yeah, anyways, you're probably all thinking, what the fuck is he talking about? Uh, so, um, the CEOs of Screams uh, a couple of weeks ago opened up for like a day and a half uh, an application process to join the CEOs of Screams. We're looking to add 10 people to the group. We had... 196 applications come in and uh captain sumi and um i believe tubin but i don't know for a fact um and then uh, i believe there's a few other people too they're on a committee that were going through the applications and whittled them down to 48 applications and from there they said hey we were going to add 10 new people, but there's a lot of good names on here. Like, there's some, there's some really talented content creators. Let's make it 15. Uh, so, yeah. So, we the last I heard from Sumi was probably three, four hours ago. And there was 31 CEOs that casted their vote out of um, a total of 78. So, um like already passed a third of the way through and I'm sure there's going to be more of them by this time tomorrow. Uh, so it's either we will find out, I should say the voting will end when either all 78 CEOs cast their vote or Wednesday, I think it was 17 UTC. So that would be minus four is 13. That's one in the afternoon Eastern standard time on Wednesday next week. Whatever happens first, either that time or all the votes are counted, we will determine top 15 vote getters get in. And then uh, I'm sure the announcement will come shortly after that. It was nuts. I can't believe that there was that. I mean, like, I, I don't remember how many people were in when I tried to, when I applied in July, well, like June of last year. Um, because that was the first, ex I was part of the first expansion. Um, I had applied at the initial 
oh, like starting of the team, and I think there was a there was like a lot of people. Well, there was no application process, but there was like they said it, it was like, hey, who's interested in the, doing this team thing? And uh, you know, there's a ton of people replying, and that was basically what it was. Uh, and that was a lot of fucking people too. But I think this may have been our biggest run yet, which is cool to see. Uh, that there's more interest in joining the team uh, than the previous time and the time before that. It's like, it's like growth, you know? We're getting our names out there. That's cool. Just so excited. Yeah, for real. And there's a lot of names, uh, a lot of people that I recommended um, to give it a shot in the application process. I think most did. And I'd say 50% of the people that I recommend, maybe a little less than 50%, maybe it wasn't a tie, definitely wasn't a majority, um, but a good chunk of those people that I recommended, um, I noticed are in the, it's in the poll, they're there. So I was like, okay, well, they're getting my vote. Like I recommended them, it'd be silly if I didn't. Um, and then I went through the people, everyone else on that same list, and I looked at every single one today. I can't if i did that that was how my afternoon went but uh interesting to see some of the other people out there and whatnot <clears throat> um and one other quick thing i just want to i want to say i came up i was thinking about this earlier today when i was talking in the discord with the other ceos and uh there's been a big push the last few weeks and trying to come up with more collaborations between the CEOs and stuff and and have like, you know, our own like CEO night or, or whatever, you know, it happens to be. Um, and I was like, you know, yeah. I've been doing a lot of single player stuff and it seems like the multiplayer I usually end up playing the most is with people that are from Channel 13. Um, and then also some of them obviously are a few of them are also CEOs of Screams, but like that's kind of like it's like yeah, that connection's already there. Um, and I love those connections, don't get me wrong. Uh, but there's so many people in the CEOs of Screams that I've like spoken to very little, haven't gamed yet, haven't sat in the same Discord voice chat with, like um, you know, there's a big opportunity there. So I came up with an idea and I'm gonna try to do it once a month. If, like, if there's enough excitement about it, maybe I'll do twice a month, but I that's going to have to be a few months in. Uh, but once a month, I'm going to be calling a, uh, a CEO's board meeting. Uh, and what's going to happen is I'm going to get, um, you know, some other amount of CEOs, uh, depending on what games we're playing and how many people can also be in the game and who's available yada yada there will be ceos that will join me here on stream and they're going to introduce themselves to all of you and we're going to go look at their channel see what they're all about and uh watch a couple clips just so you all can get an understanding of who is it that's in the who is it that is a part of this team with me and a lot of other people that i mean like we know we know people like you know sass and Eris. uh Diana, obviously, uh, power, um, creepy. I mean, like there's, there's so many names in there. Oh, Crims, one speed. There's so many fucking names in that team that we already know, but there's so many that we don't. And this is my way of thinking of like, well, how can I get, uh, you know, a time with these other CEOs I don't know, get to know them, have fun. Uh, but also be like, Hey, Come play this game with me, but also like self promo yourself a bit, like get the uh, get the information across, and that way, then you guys get to know who the fuck I actually are gaming with. Um, and uh, I mean, like for the ones that are I already know from either CEOs of Screams and or Channel Thirteen, um, I think they'll make their rounds eventually through it. They'll get their they'll get their introductions and whatnot. Even though a good chunk of them are are in this channel a lot, but that's fine. Um, so yeah, monthly 
uh, monthly board of directors meetings or <laughs> board meetings, board of directors, We're not directors, monthly board meetings for the CEOs of Screams. So, uh, heard it here first. I'll end up putting an update out about it um, a little later. I want to actually kind of work on some stuff. Um, I want to make it like really fucking cool and really special. And I think our first one is going to be in a few weeks. I do want to try to squeeze it in for April. Um, but I also have a, I have a week off from my full time job coming up and there's going to be a good amount of time that I can spend into it. So yeah, I just wanted to share that, that tidbit of information I had earlier today and you know this idea that i had and i brought up with some of the ceos and a bunch have already jumped on board with like yes we're in granted i was already talking about doing a collab but i was like let's you know let's fucking double down on this shit <sighs> okay i've yapped enough i'm already fucking late i mean it's already past 10 o'clock now so i already screwed you all out of an hour of content <laughs> we're gonna go play we are not alone Okay. Doo, doo, doo. Here we are. Uh, so I've read all the options and every tree. Yeah, stop stalling. Wow. Normal or hard? Hard difficulty removes the ability to highlight objects. This copy changed without restarting the game. Oh yeah, I'm playing normal. I, I, I don't want to have to search for items. If I can highlight them from across the room, I'm all fucking for it. I'm here for a good time, not a challenging time. <laughs> Listen, quickly. Whatever you do, do not meet her gaze. Okay. Who's talking to who? Keep your camera between you and her, or she'll come for you like she has for me. Your camera between you and her, or she'll come. Oh, okay, so consistently have to be looking at her through the camera. I don't know who she is, by the way, but okay. Hold on to that key card I gave you. Don't trust anyone. Oh God, she's here. Don't look at her. Get out. What the fuck? See if you can find us. I'll do, I'm gonna do my best. I know you'll never read this, but my psych insists writing letters can help. I haven't seen you in so long, Laura. I miss my sister. You told me to leave Osiris alone. That you working for them was safe. I abused my connections to try to find the truth, and lost my job. I've signed up for an experiment with Osiris to try to find the truth, and you. I received a confirmation. They'll be here to pick me up shortly. Yikes. Love you always, Riley. Alright, interact with object is left mouse button. Examine object is right mouse button. Space to highlight effective objects not available in hard mode. Okay, space bar. Perfect. Uh, do I just click? Oh. No, Riley. Newspaper. I don't want to take it. I can examine it, though. Camera operator fired for abuse of power. A slow news day, I guess. I don't know why I keep this around. Not my proudest moment. <laughs> Boinks. Excuse me, I hit space bar. Probably get that, or they can wait a few minutes. They can wait a few minutes. I'm busy looking at the rest of this fucking room. Photo of us. I'm not going to take the photo. 
picture of Larp before she went to study abroad. Came back with an accent and she never went back to the truly Aussie tone. I right clicked on it. Don't yell at me this time. There's some great horror literature in here. Even though I love to read, these are all Lars. My couch. I've passed out here many a time. Kill it. Breaking news. I must have left it on a movie channel or something. Here, a fern? MC from an RE game, but can't remember which. Oh, Riley looks like the main character. Okay, I see what you're saying. Uh, I can't. Fungus, my fern. As Dyer said, I'm allowed three personal items when I leave. He is one of them. This is my front door. Okay. Good morning, Riley. I'm from the Osiris Initiative. I'm afraid there's not much time. Are you ready to leave? I just need to get... Someone will be by to collect any items you requested on your application. For now, we must leave. Take this induction manual and let's go. We will also need to collect a blood sample and administer the sedative prior to the car ride. Excuse the fuck out of me. Also, I don't have a drink. What is wrong with me? Know what we're doing today? We're having a whiskey night. Nice to say to that. No, not spin 12. No, I need... I need good things to, today. Like if I if I scream because something is scary, that's fine. I expect that here. That's like going on a water ride and being upset that you got wet. Doesn't quite make sense. Pass the whiskey. Okay. You want a big ice cube too? I need these square ice cubes. Get the fucking molding around it anymore with the shit. There we go. I got it. Yeah, I just keep those in the, the little freezer compartment. <laughs> so yeah, it's the glass with the ice in it. Fits perfectly. Where? I actually legit like whiskey. Same. This stuff is okay. My uh, Sorry, I just banged the desk. This stuff's pretty good. My, uh, my father-in-law actually... Pulls it out from a cabinet above the stove. He's like, you want some? I was like, sure. And then, like, I pour like I pour some. He just goes, yeah, you could just take the bottle. I was like, uh, but it's pretty good. It's the, the Crown Royal Black. I've never been, like, a massive Crown Royal, Royal fan. Like, I'll drink it if it's offered. You know? Yeah, I got some. Okay. But um, I've never had Crown Royal Black. And it's uh, pretty decent. Smells divine. And of course, let me have the little baggie that comes with it. Just like all the Crown Royals have. This one's actually black, like the, the label. Oh, little things that go. You know. hmm. And then there's also still a bottle of Jameson here. And the pickle juice in the fridge. From the pickle bags, so who knows? That may happen one night. But anyways, not into the cheers yet. So cheers, everybody. This is for all of you that are here. Ooh, that is robust. It's the only word I could think of. Okay. Apologies for the lack of pleasantries. As I said, we don't have much time. The car's waiting downstairs. Let's head out. 
I remember one party I Jameson and I told my Uber driver my whole life story. That's amazing. I'm sure they loved that conversation. Not really one for conversation. I guess I should follow her. Yeah, let's go. Fuck it. No elevator access until the experiment comes to an end. Stupid. I hit the buttons. Buttons are nothing. I think I need a key. Oh. What up, dog? Hey, could you tell me... Please, proceed to the orientation room immediately. Damn. Okay. See what happens here. Locked. It needs a key card. Can he even do anything? Fucking hilarious. Hey, what's the second one? They're both the same thing? Oh, alright, well. Time for orientation. Yep. Riley, please take a seat. We'll get to introductions later. Right now, we have a lot to get through. Got it. <clears throat> Three hours late there. <laughs> orientation is over. Please collect your camera and head to the mess hall to meet the others. So it says, remember, keep your camera with you at all times. You need to place the camera down and ensure you will remain in frame. Using the bathroom is an exception. Do not attempt entry into restricted areas unless instructed. Please take your camera and enter the facility. It says, movement in third person with, uh, move the cursor. Mouse. Left mouse button is interact. Move to cursor. Or double click is to run. I was clicking close, move cursor over the pickup camera button and drag to continue. Moving in first persons with WASD, look around with the mouse, left shift, toggle spread. What up, bitch? These cameras are pretty bulky. Make sure to hold it up to your face at all times. We want everything you see framed perfectly. Oh, space still works. I'm not about to start stealing artwork. Oh, sorry, right click. Abstract looks like a bottle of wine and a glass to me. I can kind of see that. Fucking coffee. I've already had too much coffee today. Take dirty coffee cups with me. You sure? Looked at everything. Three months in this bunker. Let's go. Three months? Head to the mess hall. Generator. Security room. Wait, can I just go into these places? First locked right now. Okay. No way. Okay. I was gonna say, I would have fucking cracked the fuck up. Uh, main living area is, is stairs, elevator, conference. Okay. This works. Hi, Fry. What the fuck was that? Welcome in, my friend. Uh, there was something standing at the end of the hallway there for a minute. <laughs> right, as, right as I opened the door and you said good evening. I can't glitch. There's someone actually there. Time to find the mess hall. Uh, no, I'm leaving. At that point, immediately I'm leaving. Uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, that's the mess hall. Uh, dorm room for ru Oh, it's my dorm room. Oh, cool, my room. I'll check it out after I've introduced myself to everyone. Okay. Medical. 
locked. Oh, that's not good. Storage. Alright, so can't do that. Gym and showers. I do love work up and out right now. Weird. Showers in the gym. The bathroom. Right now. Form of Jeff. Of course, this is the common area with a big motherfucking TV. And we should try it out. Yeah. Another big motherfucking TV. Hold it to the wall. I can't take it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Next turn. Old looking radio. Doesn't turn on. I'll try and fix it later. Okay. Do the mess hall then. That reminds me of the original Half Life. Okay. Fill that actually. Okay. Riley, grab some food and come sit with us. Got it, Charlie. Hello? I had a backup for that? That's propaganda. We're already here. I guess they just love talking about themselves. Jesus Christ. And now, in a receptacle which is deposit rubbish. Pearson people don't understand what it is for. Oh, for fucking crying out loud. Worked for a couple of companies which toggle themselves on the walls everywhere. Same though. I need to hint. Use the hint system more than five times after the tutorial. Haha. <laughs> Get some fucking coffee. <laughs> okay, nope. They want a drink? To put food on the table if I'm gonna eat. Fine, I'll just hold on to the fucking camera. Kathy. <laughs> Library is currently locked. Oh, right. Da -da -da. Oh, fuck. Why is my neck so dark? Oh, do you mean Riley or, or physically me? I'm like, my neck is not dark. <laughs> yeah, hey, I'm Riley. I'm Riley. Nice to meet you, buddy. Game. I also didn't even notice. Hey, Riley. I'm Charlie. And that is Jeff. Nice uh -oh. to meet you, Riley. Find a place, all right? <clears throat> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Charlie, what did you do before this? Charlie, tell me about yourself. What did you do before you were here? was an IT technician for a larger company, but I was let go. The last few months for me have been looking for work. This came along at the perfect time. Yeah, fair enough, Charlie. I feel you, dude. Riley, what about you? About me. I worked as a camera operator for the local news for a few years. 
<laughs> Until I was fired. It seems we have a bit in common in that regard. Spooky. Other than that, I've been trying to find information on my sister. She signed up for one of these experiments months ago and hasn't contacted me since. <laughs> that wasn't a massive fucking red flag. Instead, you want to join it? God. That's not what I want to hear the first day we're down here. Yeah. There's someone else here. Is there anyone here apart from us? Like the security guy? They said he'd be gone from that hallway by morning. No. I mean in the Darf. hallway just now. I swear I saw someone through the camera lens, but then they were gone. Are you trying to freak me out? Don't be so jumpy. It was probably just the administrator finalizing a few things. You're probably right. Not though. Jeff, what do you do outside the bunker? So, Jeff, what did you do before joining with Osiris? I was a data analyst. Not much to tell you, or you'll be asleep before you finish your pizza. Like Charlie, I was let go from my job. Huh. How about you? Why do you both think we're down here? They said isolation experiment, but not the reason. Maybe if they tell us the reason, it'll ruin the main purpose. It's like a reality show. People know the cameras are there and act different, even if it's meant to be natural. Speaking of cameras, do we really have to hold them at eye level at all times? They're so bulky. It seems like it. As they said in the presentation, Failure to follow the rules can force the experiment to end early, which means we don't get paid. Plot twist, this is hell. Most jobs are so bulky like a moose. Well, <laughs> I'm not a fan, but I'll follow the rules. The money they've offered is insane. Getting tired. Jeff, Charlie, I'm getting a bit tired. It was nice meeting you both, but I think I'll head to bed. No worries, Riley. Have a good night. See you tomorrow, Riley. I'll pick up your motherfucking camera. Now I need to. Library is locked. I'm assuming the kitchen is locked. It only seems to work for those that have kitchen duty. Oh, shock and awe. Get some sleep. Oh, God. Okay. I better find my room and get some sleep. Um, here. Ellie. See what kind of accommodation they provided. Wow, they really went all out here. I was expecting a tiny bed and concrete floors. A actually, yeah. Dirty plate, what do I have that? Oh, for crying out loud. Anyways, let me look around for everything else here. I brought my laptop. Maybe I'll check the news after getting some sleep. You think they're going to give you internet access? Girl, you are out of your fucking mind. Come in handy. Liar's cool. Fungus. Made it. I hope they treated you nicely. Fucking burn. It's fine. No shower, no toilet, just a sink. Uh, there are bathrooms separately. If we did see that. But still, yeah, it's a little questionable.
Hey, Uncle, I feel much cleaner. Oh no, the sink is blocked. Looks like there's something sticking out of the drain. Sink, where you wash your hands. Blocked, something is sticking out of the drain. Okay, so let's use the pliers and pull it out of the sink. Blocking this drain. Oh, gross, it's a large chunk of hair. Strange, the same color as mine. At least that's fixed. Fix the sink. That's a bidet. <laughs> so take a look at the painting. I haven't done that. Saturate from oh for fuck's sakes. Tell thanks for all the support. Strange title, but I bet they truly meant it. Time to get changed. That's better. Okay. Shower curtain. Huh. Nice prison jumpsuit. It's a nice place for playing hide and seek. Oh, for fuck's sakes, Riley, you're ridiculous. All that. Oh, light switch. Light's only dim. That's going to take some getting used to. Well, it's probably because if it's completely fucking dark, you'll sleep all day. That, yeah, only one thing left. Head to bed. Good morning. That was the best sleep I've had in a while. Time to get ready and head out. Objective updated. Vacuum the main living area? Why? So we have to get dressed. I'm not overdressed for this. to go. I can leave the lights. Oh, wait, no, no, no. All right, the camera. I'll need to collect it before I leave my room. <laughs> we both did the same thing. Ryan, welcome in, my friend. Hope you're doing well, my dude. Got the camera. Be Gucci. All right, let's see what this day has in store for me. So, just remember to check your tasks daily. You're here for three months. We need to keep you busy. You do? That's too bad. Riley, as you were a little late, if you have any questions, please ask Jeff or Charlie. This is the last you'll see of me for 90 days. Good luck and enjoy. Bye, Administrator. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Riley. I didn't really expect to be given chores down here. It makes me feel like a teenager again. <laughs> I know, right? I thought this would be a relaxing experiment. I will keep you busy till the end of time. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, I can sleep while the first night in a new environment. She must be a sociopath. It's true. So... Apparently, I have to do group meeting in the morning, vacuum the main living area in the afternoon, and then hey, Jeff, three times. Any evening. idea where I can find a vacuum cleaner? Try the storage closet around the corner. Thanks. Oh, but you'll need a code. Do you know the code for the storage room? It's weird they'd lock it. Uh, it's two one. Honestly, I was kind of zoning out. Maybe check with Charlie? Unbelievable. Did Charlie say where he was going? He said he had time before he had to begin cooking and that he would be in his room. Bye, Jeff. See you around. See you later, Riley. Thanks, fan. Okay. 
<clears throat> Hold to the bike. <sighs> you guys have two squares all down here. I guess I need to find if I can pick up the camera. Go we'll try to find Charlie. Charlie's room. It's Riley. I'm coming in. Hey, Riley. Pop that camera down and come have a chat. Yeah, pop that camera down and come on over. Feel his laptop right in front of him. Won't power on. Oh, okay. Hey, Charlie. Hey, Riley. How's your day going, Charlie? Better than yours. Good job being late for the first day. The administrator was very impressed. Thanks, Charlie. If they wanted us to be on time, they wouldn't have made the bed so comfortable. Your bed's comfortable? Want to trade? <laughs> no. No. What's on the menu for tonight? I haven't been to the kitchen yet. Hopefully something that tops the pizza they gave us last night. Do you know the code for the storage room door? Jeff said he zoned out when the administrator was talking. I had to force myself to stay awake during that presentation. As for the code, it's 2702-2024. Today's date. Oh, February 27th, 2024. I read that. Like, I knew what they were going for. And I was like, why is this puzzling to me? <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Charlie coming in clutch. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, February 27th of this year. It doesn't seem super secure. I wonder why they locked it. Anyway, thank you. Bye, Charlie. See you soon, Riley. Yeah, the shading in her neck is really strange. Now you mentioned that shuffle. Oh, no. Alright. E pad. Oh! Awesome. Love that. Success. Bottles of soap, lubricant. Hell yeah, brother. Metal bar, a flashlight. Batteries? I don't need that right now. Or ever, I don't have a lighter. Fair enough. Metal bar? Doesn't look pretty. Uh, okay. have any stuck bolts that need this okay take these right back and clean what else do we have in here coffee machine enough in the bathroom and it should evergreen ustastrophe bookmark in it that says backer at heck in the way Oh, interesting. Somebody backed this project, I guess. The name tossed in it. That's pretty cool. Evergreen Goose Astrophy by Hacking the Way. What's there been geese eating apricots and thirsty cats pounced on the watermelon in Timothy's backyard? Timothy screams, No, my sweet Caroline Georgia, will you be my paid farmer? Honk, long, bonk, stonk, said the geese. We rage peace upon apricots. Meow, cow, said the cat. Yoshi was big mad and left his satchel. Timothy turned and ordered the satchel for three days. Big Brain Robbie said, Thus days have been without Yoshi. Therefore the noodles are soft. Those dastardly cats confounded all my watermelons. If a hero comes to Afghanistan, bread will return, said Bartholomew the exasperated. What is this? 
Ah, screeched Carolina, Georgia. Yes, but you stifle your burgeoning kerfuffle bunnies, said Carolina, Georgia. Buckets of butter sauce sat con contemplatively bubbling big brain time riddles laid upon the grassy stairs. Only smart prophecies can rend these apples and knobby pumpkins. So try orange juice, because nutrients is divinity. And then bunnies fluttered in triplicate synchronicity into the fluffy clouds, embraced by long necks to endowed with bumpy, numply whiskers. Why did you besmirch me with these scruffy eyebrows, you toe-eyed satchel cabbage? Bellowed Carpal Tunnel Sally. What a name. Michael Sally bellowed back at Sally. Why bring Gary into a serious circus when he barely stops to talk into your lily pads? Be framed from unsanctified elmos, but Brandon called the apricot police and dropped his glasses. It was then that Guccifer rose, calling out, Honk, honk my horns, cheerfully. Yoshi rode side saddle beside Cacti, and Curtis called, O oh, mighty beetroot, thou cometh to me verily, soggily to thou's rhythmic king. Finally, the geese brought apricots and peace to evergreen Afghanistan. All was glorious and satchels grazed merrily in golden stairs. The end, or is it? Merrily, Raven Dove and his squab. I look to talk into my lily pads any time. I hope there's a sequel. Oh my god. Okay, cool. Take this with me, get my chores done, and then I can explore until dinner. Cool. Jesus fucking Christ. Why are we doing this with mannequins? Fuck. <laughs> Sorry, Riley. You mentioned seeing something, and I thought this would be hilarious. What a dick. Screw you, Jeff. Don't ever do that again. Yeah, Jeff. Absolute jerk. Let's get this vacuuming over and done with. Day two, evening. Right. Now that's done, I can either go get some food or explore a little. What does it say to do? Explore and have dinner. Okay. We'll explore then. Check out the gym. Wow, I didn't expect a fully equipped gym down here. Nothing but the best. Hello? I... I really broke over here when I walked over here. All right, can I just right-click it? No. Okay. That's cool. Whoever it was, I'm not cleaning up after them. Christ. You can run, walk, or even jog on this. Amazing. Is it, though? Nah, not right now. Don't want to work out right now. Why? Check out the bathrooms. Fully equipped? You may have too high expectations on gyms because to me, this is pathetic. <laughs> the valve that controls water flow to parts of the bunker. Cool, I'm not gonna fucking touch that. I can't open it? I can't do anything with it? Oh. Self care products don't need any of them. Okay, you should go just don't fucking eat anything. I think it's broken. This to main living area. Okay, that's the other door. Is anyone in there? 
This better not be one of your bloody pranks, Jeff. Your bloody pranks, Jeff. Okay. Yo, Wandale, welcome in, my dude. How you doing? All clean. Dry your fucking hands. Broken. Awesome. Let's uh, pick up the camera and get out of the bathroom. Avoid that one, even though the thing was just in here, all the way over here. Good playing stay stay a while. Oh, cool. Hope it's good. There's the gym. I guess I could have gone through the other door. It doesn't really fucking matter. Yep. Jeff. It's locked, no going in there. Oh. Okay then. Charlie. Mess hall. My room. Oh, medical. Fine. Storage is all set. I'll go get some food. Oh, clicked on it. Day 15 morning. Jesus. Another great sleep. I can't believe it's been 15 days already. Time to catch up with the guys for breakfast. That was quick. Very mundane tasks, I guess. Pesky fucking ads. Actually, I remember all that with breakfast this Oh, Tree, thank you for the sub. Oh, good morning, Jeff. Gibson it out to Wandale. Appreciate you. Very nice. Morning, Riley. How are you doing this morning? Can't complain. Well, could complain about the food. As we just said, he, that dude went all out. Yeah. It's pretty basic, but it'll do. Has Charlie said anything to you? He seems really nervous about something. He seems to have gone downhill over the past few days. Maybe this is what they're trying to gain from this experiment. I'm a bit worried about him. We should both keep an eye on him. Has the administrator gotten back to you about your sister yet? Not yet. It's much harder to dig around for information in here than I thought, too. Yep, everything is pretty well locked down. Maybe there's something in the Sector 2 area. I doubt we'll be allowed in there before our time is up, though. The toast was actually pretty good. I'd better get onto these chores now. <laughs> the toast. See you soon, Jeff. No more ads. See ya, Riley. Oh, wait. I heard Charlie muttering to himself earlier. It sounded like she is following me. Mm -hmm. Strange. We definitely need to keep a close eye on him.
Lots of tribute. Otherwise, I'm stuck with 221 of ads. <laughs> the library oh already have enough books in your room okay fine first my daily chores and then I have scheduled free time this afternoon okay all subjects please note there is a malfunction with the generator Riley Please investigate. The Sector 2 door is now unlocked. Why can't they send one of their own to investigate? What do I know about a generator? About generators? For real. Oh shit. I'm not going out there if she's out there. Jesus. Guard is gone. Of course he is. Feels like we're a bunch of D-class. Yeah, effectively shuffle. Where am I supposed to be fucking going? Investigate the generator. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Generator's down here. These no smoking. Huh, what's that noise? Oh, it's a fucking fire? Oh, God, I need to stop this fire quickly. How did they, how did they know about this? They have cameras everywhere. Right, there's gotta be a uh, no toolbox, whiskey, towels. So door is stuck. I can't. I gotta use something to break it. They have a liquid on the ground. I say like, place the camera. Oh wait, I can't, I can't pick this thing up. It would come in handy, thank you. I'll place it down. Wrench on the fucking fire extinguisher keys. Oh Lord Jesus is a fire. <laughs> Here goes nothing. There you go. All right, now to not step on the shards of glass and cut myself, okay, really? Okay. Oh. Hope this thing is full. Jesus Christ. That didn't look like the same person either. Hey, it's out. Let's hope the damage wasn't too severe. I, that's not out. Oh, there you go. And you try to power it back up. It seems fire caused it to shut down. Makes sense. Much too heavy to move. Okay. Only those two things. Let's pick up the camera and look around. document. Company messed up the crate design again. Our name is backwards. Please cancel our contract with them. Uh oh, someone is in trouble. It is backwards. <laughs> Box needs a key card. Okay. Life to it. The generator was just on fire. Don't try to turn it back on. Yeah. <laughs> Need any of those tools? Stupid. Evidence found. 
tempting, but no. Here that. It's a fire. How did this happen? Looks to just be on the surface. I what? Hopefully I could just hit the buttons then. Yep, great. Why did I shuffle? Looks like someone drunk near generator. <laughs> cool. Problem fucking solved. Both these doors were locked. Nothing else to do. Found all the evidence I could see. Time to go. Yep, we out. Till next fire. Okay, I'm done here. I should try and find out who did this. I need to figure out who lit that fire and why. Sorry for that, yeah. I need to go into the orientation room. Okay. Iteration eight. Level five. Okay. okay. Somebody did it. Why so is awesome? <laughs> I need to speak to both Jeff and Charlie. You. Charlie first. Wonder if Wrench is able to use as a weapon. Probably not. Charlie, if you're in there, I need to speak to you right now. Charlie? Charlie, if you're in there, I need to... Alright, so he's clearly not in there. Oh, we'll check the mess hall after. That's my room. They shouldn't be in there. Uh, nobody in medical. Right. Uh, no one in storage. Oh, you motherfucker. Now we can check that as well. Jeff's room. Not here last I saw him. He was in the mess hall. Alright. We'll go through the bathrooms and gym just to cover this area. Place your camera and go about your business. Thing out of whack here. There's nobody there. Okay. To the mesh hall. Charlie? Locked? Riley? Is that you? The door is stuck. The lockdown is over. Let me see if I can find a way to open it. No rush. Just, uh... Don't go near the pot plant when you get in here. I just want to pry open this door. I guess this means he would have had a hard time getting fire to the generator, though. Hmm. Let's see. Can I try to use the wrench on the door? It doesn't need to be wrenched. Go check out storage. What's up, Riz? The lighter fluid is missing. The one I found in the generator was from our storeroom. Hmm. Cool, that might work. Also, this plunger could work. 
Hope you're doing well, Riz. Jeff, stand back. Thanks for the save, Riley. No worries. It was only the latch that seemed caught. Any other issues with the door, and I don't think it would have worked. Are you doing okay, Jeff? Yeah, I was just a little cramped in there, is all. Yeah, have you seen Charlie? Have you seen Charlie at all since this morning? Unless there's a secret escape hatch in the kitchen somewhere, I've been locked in there and haven't seen anyone. What happened earlier? Did you fix the generator? Yeah. Someone had set fire to the generator. Someone? We don't have access to that area. Is there someone else here? That's what I'm trying to find out. Charlie was acting very strange this morning. He didn't join us and just walked out. He has been a bit out of sorts lately, but come on, it's Charlie. It's only been 15 days, Jeff. We don't know the real Charlie. Still, I don't think he did this. We don't even have access to that area. You said not to look at the pot plant in the mess hall. Why? I got desperate, Riley. There's no toilets. I wish I hadn't asked. <laughs> I'm going to look around and try to find Charlie. Well, knock yourself out. I'm going to try to get some sleep. Hey, Jeff, I'm pretty certain he's probably in my room being a creep. But we will check his room first. That sounded like it came from Charlie's room. Okay. Charlie, are you okay? The door. Uh, I'm coming in. Please don't be hurt. Uh. struggling. That's so sad. I really have to. I hate tight spaces. Yeah. Alright. Here we go. My brother's room a mess. Oh, shit. Charlie, you have some explaining to do. Please. Put the camera down and we can chat. The security room. How the fuck? Greetings. I work with the Obscure Times. I'm calling to tell you that I got an interesting tip off. That your company has been involved in, shall we say, shady affairs and malpractices that date back to the 70s. Thanks. Did I grab your attention yet? Anyway, all that can go away with just a push of a button, provided we come to an amicable and reasonably sized settlement. You know how to reach me. Don't take too long, or else. <laughs> At Eddie Guard 98, beside that is written backer. Oh, okay, nice. That's cool. Document regarding weapon usage. As mentioned in your security induction, all weapons are fitted with high velocity tranquilizer rounds only. While the guns may look scary, it's primarily an intimidation technique. If you require live ammunition for any reason, there's some available in the level one armory. 
Smaller, easy to use tranquilizer guns are also development. Hmm. Remember, single shot means a sleepy subject. I feel like I must have been shot then. That's my apartment. They're watching me there too. Lighter. Oh yeah, I could call it the lighter. Put it down. Better be fucking facing him. Charlie, what the hell is going on? You won't leave me alone. I always feel like somebody's watching me. Why did you break into this room? We could get removed from the experiment. I don't think this experiment is about testing our sanity in isolation. I believe it's much more sinister, and I wanted proof. I have dreams about this bunker, but everything is slightly different. I'm single, yet I have dreams about a wife and kids that seem too real. Dreams of saying goodbye before I came here. What did you mean by, she won't leave me alone? Who? The woman in the shadows. I think you've seen her too. Mm -hmm. That's just been a glitch in the camera, Charlie. Nothing sinister. I looked at her with my own eyes and not the camera. She tried to attack me now. And I keep seeing her. Sleep, yeah. It's just a dream, Charlie. Feels too real, and when waking, it feels more like a memory. I woke up and knew there was a grate behind my shelf. Explain that. Did you find anything in here? Yeah, and you may want to see this. Oh, day 15 experiment, iteration number eight, location floor five. Candidates are Townshend, C. Outerman, and G. Experiment status safe. Huh. Could be us, right? Experiment revision ineligible location floor four. And it's L Townshend. Must be my sister. Terminate dependent cleanup crew. Oh. Long page is unreadable. Oh. My god. Laura. This document says Laura was on a lower level and the experiment was terminated. <laughs> yeah, um... Terminated her or the experiment? That's all I've found, Riley. I've searched the entire room. I know you're already stressed out, but I have to ask. Did you start the fire earlier? I needed a distraction. I felt it was the only way for me to get around the facility. One mystery solved. I was ready to throttle you for breaking in here. But I think you've done the right thing. We need to dig further and find more information. No wonder the administrator brushed me off when I asked. I want to dig more into these memories. For now, Charlie, I suggest we both get some rest. And for God's sake, clean up your room. <laughs> We didn't start the fire, but Charlie did that fucking so Okay, Charlie, fire. let's both get some sleep and regroup in the morning. Should we go tell Jeff? Can we trust him? I'd keep it between us for now. We need to be very cautious. about Charlie, but I'm more worried about my sister right now. Carl tried to dig further into all this.
Right, and there's probably no key cards anywhere. Dude starts a fire and she treats him like a naughty child. Pickle my pickle for nickel. Guinea pigs. <laughs> I don't know if there's anything else lying around, but... We're good. Let's go. If I pass it, I hope you love the game. I'd be going in burrito mode. Xbox will be administrator. You're the administrator? No way. That's awesome. I didn't even, I didn't even think that was you. I need to go to the bathroom. I've already gotten changed, but the camera dummy bag could just run out and back quickly. Oh, I think I'll leave it there. Go to the bathroom. Hey! Okay. Yes, way. That's awesome. at her. Oh, what do we do here? What do we do? She's sprinting. Dude, what the fuck? Okay. Can't follow you either. Jesus Christ. I was talking about, or am I just losing it? First, the toilet, then sleep. Okay. Someone is in the shower. I won't bother them right now. Okay. Someone screaming? Yes, yes, it was. What the fuck? One of the pipes is burst. I won't get through here unless I shut off the water. It's too tight, I can't turn it with my bare hands. Makeshift crowbar? Okay, wrench? Yes. At that point, just pee on the floor. Just a little more. Oh, shit. The wrench broke? What kind of low quality? Oh, there's so much blood. It looks like Charlie's camera, too. Hope he's okay. Rescue leave. All this blood must definitely be Charlie's. Her. 
Try to get a clear recording of this. I'm gonna try and find Charlie. Dragged off this way, I think. No more blood, but it was in this direction. Unauthorized use of the elevator detected. Please stop immediately or security will be dispatched. That doesn't sound good. I better hurry there. Rats. Oh god. Charlie? No. Behind. Uh oh. Who dressed me? How did I get back here? Oh God, Charlie! I have to tell Jeff what happened. It get wild. I'm gonna go break news about Charlie to Jeff. There's Jeff's room. Jeff, are you there? I really need to talk to you. Guess he must be elsewhere. Unless something happened to him too. Yeah, shit. Right, we'll go check the mesh at uh, the mess hall. That's usually his whereabouts. Yep. Jeff. Oh, thank God. There you are. Are you okay? Oh. What's up, Riley? You seem really stressed. Charlie. I saw... Deep breaths, Riley. Compose yourself. Okay. Okay. That's better. Where were you last night? Emergency lights? Sirens? I was banging on your door. I heard you knocking. I got locked in. At least you didn't need a crowbar this time. Jeff, I don't know how to tell you this, but Charlie's gone. Gone? Where? When the emergency lighting kicked in, he was in the elevator. There was so much blood. Uh. <clears throat> I don't know how anyone could survive it. Then there was the soldier. Oh, hi. Good morning, everyone. How are we doing? Uh, what? What the Riley, I love pranks, but given Charlie's mental state recently, that was not fun. No, neither, right? No, I saw a bit agitated. Obviously, you two have a bit to talk about, and you've really spoiled my mood. I'm heading to my room. I don't want to be disturbed. Hey, Jeff. Is Jeff okay? What did I miss? Charlie, what happened last night? What do you mean? There were sirens, my door locked, and now here I am. I saw your blood in the shower. I saw you covered in blood. I saw the her that you told me about. You were in the elevator and the soldier shot at me. Riley, please try and take are you sure this wasn't a nightmare? I mean, I'm here right in front of you. 
Yesterday when we spoke, you seemed extremely agitated, remember? Sitting in the corner, your leg jittering and you running off while I was talking to Jeff? I don't know what you mean, Riley. <clears throat> you broke into the security room. You were talking about your family and how you miss them. Doing something like that would jeopardize the entire experiment. You know I'm only doing this for the money. You also said about her not leaving you alone. I saw her. She chased me. Her? The administrator? <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. No, her. The shadowy creature. I'm sorry, Riley. Maybe you need to take some time off. We can report this to Osiris. It sounds like the isolation may be getting to you. What about the soldier, then? The one that shot at me? Riley, you're really worrying me. Please, get some rest. We'll file a report with Osiris and see if they can provide some support. I am not going crazy. Something weird is happening here. I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. I... I'm going to go. Please come see me if you need anything, Riley. You'll be okay. Whatever you say, cowboy, whatever you say, there's some reptilian bullshit going on around here. I ain't having any of it. I gain access to the stairwell. Right, sector two is locked unless they unlock. Uh, excuse me. Let's go check out our room. Is there anything in here we can? Uh... Look at mm -hmm. Riley has no reflection. Done, done, done. I don't think he's in there. He wouldn't fucking answer anyways. He said he doesn't want to be disturbed. Go check the bathrooms, I guess. Oh, it's still scared of the middle stall, I see. I want there to be a game where that is relevant. <laughs> Storage, medicals locked, that's my room. S Hall. Charlie. I could sneak in, he's still in the mess hall. Good idea. Charlie's bed.
Night, Dragon Mom. Headed to bed early. Take care. Take it easy, Tree. Hope you sleep well, my dude. Thanks for hanging. Appreciate you. All right, let's see. Hope this works. Crowbar broke rest in peace, little buddy. God damn it. Oh, for fucking crying out loud. Screws. Fucking God. Work. I didn't think so either. Okay. Screwdriver. I'm gonna say storage. Makes the most sense. see a screwdriver in storage that's not good you have a screwdriver no. Oh, the batteries. I think I should be able to use the radio now. Okay. I just need to tune it a little. I repeat, reports continue to come in from major cities indicating that mass... Private residences are no longer uh, a radio player or something. Yeah, fix the radio. Heard something from the outside world. Dun 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 dun. Screwdriver in here. I wonder if we should go in the mess hall and look for one. I guess Charlie's in the kitchen. I wonder if there's anything useful in here.
I assume nothing in there. Now, he doesn't have a fucking screwdriver randomly, does he? Now, will there be a fucking screwdriver in this neck of the world? I am unsure the screwdriver is supposed to be. Look at a dirty plate from three weeks ago. Yeah, pretty impressive. In fact. Ah, uh, sorry. I could have not done this, but I would have been carrying a dirty dish around for a while. One of the good ones. Place your dirty plate in the dishwasher. Nice. One less fucking thing to do.
Oh, is there no screwdriver? Right, some of that plate like a teddy bear. This were IRL and it'd use a knife the kitchen, yeah. I can just walk around and hopefully I get to the right room of the game. So how I got back in here. Where am I supposed to go? Go back there. Bottle of soap, lubricant, flashlight without batteries, fire extinguisher, plunger, toilet paper, a book, coffee machine. Nothing there. Just in here. Yeah, the problem is I can't get into the kitchen, otherwise, yeah, I'd have a much easier time. And then don't work out. Ay, ay, ay. How difficult is it to fucking hide one key? Let me go to the mesh room and see if I can get to the kitchen. None of this makes sense. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here.
Make it seem like there was something important in here. Run the table if I'm gonna eat. game was getting really good too and I had no fucking idea what happened. Like, I don't know why this is so difficult to... I want to walk through but it was of the demo and it ends with Charlie in the elevator. Oh, fuck. <laughs> well, thank you so much for trying. Searching for a screwdriver or anything that would help me rotate the fucking thing. You try this, but have you looked under the mat in the gym? I don't think I specifically did that because when I tried to move it, I was like, I'm not cleaning up after someone else's mess. Today's a different day. Whoever it was, I'm not cleaning up after them. Yeah, it's. Always watching. Wazowski. Excuse me. Why I clicked there.
the only thing you haven't tried is putting down the camera in various rooms. Yeah, that's true. that I clicked. Oh. It is mentioning that, huh? Nothing in the bin to take. Okay. A butter knife. I remember my dad using one of these as a screwdriver and a pen. Shuffle, you called it. I never checked the fucking drawers. <laughs> My brain is fucking mush, clearly. broke too come on how am I supposed to lock this all back up this is it time to go uh yeah now or never Air vent is back in place. It also sounds like someone moved the bookshelf back into position. No going back now. Fuck. Are the doors open? Correct the guards, they all need to find a way to distract them. Read a distraction. There's to be something in here that I can use to distract that soldier. Also, how is this room still filled with smoke? <laughs> I mean, I could just light this generator on fire. There's nothing. Much too heavy to move. It seems fire caused it to shut down. Yep. Okay. It's worked when Charlie did it. Let's see if it does the trick again.
You know, I light this thing up. Seems like a safe distance. I'll throw the lighter just to be safe. Yeah, it worked. Hopefully this distracts the guy. Unauthorized use of the elevator detected. Please stop immediately or security will be dispatched. Oh, who's using the fucking elevator? There's been no one to be seen or heard. Now is one of those times. See to toggle crouch, stay crouch, and stick to dark places to avoid being seen. Hey. I can hear someone coming. I'd better sneak. Seems like a nice hiding place. Okay, let me go in. Shit. Not again. He's just doing a routine of walking in a square. It fucking looks like it. So we just have to time it right. No. I was closed. The stairwell isn't guarded anymore. Oh, God. Charlie? Hey, Riley, I thought I'd find you here. Don't put your camera down, trust me. Charlie, you were acting so normal earlier. Was that just an act? No. It wasn't until I returned to my room and had moved the bookshelf to lose myself. A note I had written to myself, it seems. A note you don't remember? Uh, shit, fire begins to robotically square dance. <laughs> exactly. It brought back memories and had this key card in it. Also made me remember something about your sister. What about Laura? Please tell me. me at the end of each experiment, wiped my mind and put me back, I just don't know. So she might still be alive? I'm sorry, Riley. I just don't know. What do we do now? My mind is reeling from all this news. Take my card. If you really want to find answers, I don't think they'll be on this floor. You need to go deeper. think that we're running out of time. There's a few things I need to tell you quickly, so please, listen closely. Stone Cold E.T. Oh, hell, yeah. <laughs> What's up, Heavy? How you doing, man? There's something else in here. We are not alone. Hey, they said it. Whatever you do, do not meet her gaze. Keep your camera between you and her, or she'll come after you. That is why Osiris is adamant about looking through the lenses. Riley, don't trust. God, she's behind you. Take care of her. Don't look at her. Get to the stairs. Oh no, my camera. Just run.
God, Charlie, I need to find a new camera before that thing finds me. Give us the cameras to protect us, otherwise I probably wouldn't bother. Oh no, it looks like I dropped a few items in the commotion. Everything except for... E-card, SL2. Locked, I guess the only way is down. Okay. So many soldiers, I don't want to risk it. Wow. Smart. I need to change that bio. I'm for sure not there for anymore. Uh, Bad, how are you? Uh, my brain is soup. And I've run down today. Whatever you do, do not meet her gaze. They will get you fancy and safe. No, it doesn't. Reminder interact with objects. What is this doing here? It looks like a little horn. Oh god. What's this? Found in staff office. Important. Can all staff please remember to follow the new security protocols? Desirous High Command, I've asked that all surfaces be scrubbed after use of the provided plastic gloves are used when handling any object to prevent fingerprints being left behind. It's only it's only until the system flaw is fixed that it detects blood flow on fingers. Adam Zell, IT admin. Uh, is there something behind my rustling? Soon, sir. This window looks far too sturdy to break. Use the panel beside the door. Okay, let's try to use the key card for it, see if it does anything. Accepts the card, but needs a fingerprint. Okay. How about this one? I don't think that will work with that. It's a. F oh, that's a keypad. This one doesn't have a lock at all, so I might be able to get there. Yep. Office area. Okay. Nothing on this desk worth taking. Desk worth. I wanna fuck you like an animal, oh, I wanna fine. feel you from the inside, I wanna fuck you like an animal, my whole existence is flawed, you get me closer to God. <laughs> What's up, Satan? Welcome in, dude. Must be very sticky, there's some white powder already stuck to it. Sniff, phew, it's just flour. What did I just pick? Oh, it's tape dispenser. I'm like, what the fuck did I just find? <laughs> Into the break room. Yo, what's up, Polish? Oh, shit. Well, fucking take that. I guess I could take this, even if it has been in someone's hand. Bag of flour. Oh, this gives me an idea. Does it? Roll of garbage bags? Sure, why not? Seems to be jammed. 
Give me a second while I google the lyrics to the hand that feeds or whatever Nine Inch Nails song was in Smackdown vs Raw Here Comes the Pain. I don't recall a Nine Inch Nails song being in Here Comes the Pain. <laughs> Oh, plastic bags, bag of flour, tape dispenser, a kitchen knife, and a seashell, and the other. We're trying to get into find a new camera and get into the IT office. Just wanted to stop in and say hey before I hit the hay. You are the man jug. Stay classy. Thanks, Polish. Hope you're having a good night. Hope you get some good sleep tonight, my dude. Pain. 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 Let's see. Oh, if I use the tape on here, can I snag? I don't think that will work with that. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Try the seashell. Fuck it. Thanks for enjoy staying up till 4 a.m. or whatever you do. <laughs> I guess I'll have someone who listens to you like Polish to that breakdown for real. He's let the prince from the sea sh from the seashell. Okay, that I didn't think of, but I don't know how to use. It was very sick, but I could pick up almost anything. You are correct. The game I was thinking of is WWE Smackdown vs. Raw 2007. And the song is called Animal I Have Become <laughs> by Three Days Grace. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Pain I'm going through. Pointy, it kind of looks like a horn. Uh, I fucking... I don't know how to like... No click and drag ability. I'm very confused. Yo ho, Rez, what's up? Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're doing well on this uh, thirsty Thursday, or free Friday, whatever you want to call it. I'm scared. If we're not alone, who's with us? Honestly, though. So. 
There must be a place I could put the seashell down. I don't think it'll work there. Brother, I'm not trying to make it work. I want to fucking put it down for a second. Oh, actually, it's probably lifting prints from the knife. But anyway, I was thinking put flour in the trash bags. Think about doing it, testing Tuesday or something else, playing the retro game. That's cool. Yeah, even, even still, though, like, definitely, like, oh, you know what? Unless I can put it back in the spot. I read. Uh, name for it, but now I can't think of what I wanted it to be. I do this and put it back. I can't put it back. Who did some voice acting for this? Uh, Diana and Vandra did. I can't put anything down anywhere. Was I was I not supposed to pick all these things up before I used the tape? This fucking game. For real. Can't even fucking leave. My God, dude. Far too sturdy to break. Let's fucking try that. No. Fucking carve my name into it. Use the horn. Assume you can't combine the knife with anything? No, I, I guess not. Like, if it's already in this inventory, I can't combine it with anything else in the inventory. I could combine it, I could use it on objects that are in game. I can't use it on myself, right? I'm just, I'm really at a loss here. I don't know what I can possibly do, unless I'm- oh! Oh, der. Wait, 
How does that not work? I can't even select anything here. And that was just the door in and of itself. Yeah, shuffle. Board lit up? What do you mean? Which keyboard? This one here? Gilson L. Copywriter? Nelson L. Copywriter. First. Black on the desk says IT. Okay. Putting tape on the desk won't work. Okay. Flower. Very brilliant plan. Here we go. A bit too much. system in this room it shows eye on the desk I was thinking flyer with keyboard dun 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 yeah exactly well, I really didn't expect that to work Panel reads unblocked. I guess it'll stay that way until I lock it again. I'm not to the fingerprint smudge. I'll get rid of it. Huh? Fuck. Oh shit. No way, an actual crowbar, not like my crappy makeshift one from earlier. Box of cards.
do feel much safer with the camera in my hands. Maybe if Charlie had his with him, things would have turned out differently. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, Vandra, I can hear The keypad acts like an intercom. If you can hear me, use it. Hello? Really? Is that... Ugh. Never mind. I need your help. They've placed the bunker into lockdown and I can't get out. First, I want answers. What the hell is going on here? Where's my sister? What is that thing that killed Charlie? I know this sounds cliche, but we don't have time right now. If you can lift the lockdown, get me out. I'll show you the answers. I don't know if I want to be showed the answers. Head downstairs, the security office. There must be a way to remove the lockdown from there. Okay, I'll be back. Don't you go anywhere. I want my answers. Alright, so further down, we just have to go back up to this door. Of course, a glue stick. Oh. Cool, I now have my own unicorn. It looks like a bit shady, though. Feels like a painting. Shady you, Osiris founder. Darren Y, Osiris founder. Rather shady looking in front of where I could eat. Apparently in the shade. I'm gonna find the security office. The administrator said the security office was. I figured it was worth a shot. <laughs> this is door to level two. What do we need to get on? Get the security office. Well, there's not too many levels to go, so. No entry. The floor below has been quarantined. No staff are permitted to enter unless. Under the strict orders from Osiris Central Command, attempts to access the area will result in your immediate termination disposal for the sake of all mankind. Yikes. Security looks tough. I don't see anybody in there. Okay, so not at this floor then. This is where I started. Damn it. Let me 
is downstairs. Level three. Okay, now it works. Shit. I'm gonna make this quick. Oh no. I've got the camera. I'm safe. I've got the camera. Safe. Security office, where could you be? Pool? How come our floor doesn't have a pool? Damn. Fucking got him, boys. That is a deep fucking pool. Look at this. Let's have a look. Due to the extreme depth in this pool, a variety of filters and pressure checking equipment must be maintained and set correctly. Failure to follow these structures could lead to damage to these critical systems. Hmm. <sighs> For temperature, make sure it's never set above 80 Celsius unless supervised by a qualified technician. And make sure it should never be anything other than 20, 80, or 90, 10. This will not mimic real world examples and may cause issues if the incorrect pump is installed in said mixture. Okay. For external pressure, never raise it above 15. This will place undue strain on the motors. Plus, override key is present. Send to 21 process to automatically reset. And all changes will be reset. Once temperature, mix, and pressure have been set, select confirm. So, no, I'll leave this here for now. with my camera not a smart idea uh -huh. don't want to mess with this without good reason sounds good Not going for a dip in the pool today. Somebody has to. Unicorn? No crowbar the pool open. I didn't fucking see that door before. Oh, wait. Shoot, there's a guard here. I need to find a way to distract them before I can search. So I have to fuck with the pool, probably. Unicorn will need to be used when you find Candy Mountain. I I agree. I think that's exactly. Is what's this? I want to take a cigarette butt or the ashtray?
come back here. It won't even let me go past. Wow. Okay. There's something I have to distract with the pool, but I have no idea if I'm supposed to be fucking with it because it won't let me do all this shit. Oh, now it opens. For fuck's sakes. Jesus Christ. So don't go over 80C, right? So 100C. Uh, Max needs to, it had to be either 20 to 80 or 90 to 10. 50 to 50 sounds good. Pressure level, yeah, let's max it out. Nothing noticed about happening that things weren't right. Go through this again. Oh, right, I can't hit twenty. There's gotta be fifteen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. And we'll hit 100 C that next and this don't go above level 15 nothing all right let's be nice then So confused. <sighs> never said above 80 Celsius, you said, said it to 100. It should never be anything other than 20 or 90 10, as this will not mimic real world examples. It may cause issues if the pump is itself for set texture. Well, I fucked that up. Well, I, like, I purposely was fucking it up. Next our pressure never is above 15. We've only been at 15. Well, 20 the first time. Been at 15, and that last one was 10. <sighs> Excuse me. So... 
go over 80 C's. Let's do 40 to 70 mix. And then we have to keep it at or below. Nothing. All right, let's try to do it the right way. Temp is 80 C. Using 9 to 10 mix. 15. Use the key card with the control panel. No. Here's not. It is fucking pool. Wait a minute. Like a pathway down there. <laughs> I'm just, I just don't get this hint. You would think I'm trying, like, I'm trying to break it, right? Because I'm trying to make noise. Failure to follow these instructions can lead to damage to this critical system. Cool. Temperature. Make sure it never set above 80 Celsius unless you are a qualified technician. Fine, we'll boost it up. Make sure it should never be anything other than 20, 80, or 90, 10, as this will not mimic real world examples. It may cause issues if the incorrect pump is installed for set mixture. And for external pressure, never raise above 15. This will place undue strain on the motors. Unless otherwise, otherwise is present setting to 20 will cause the system automatically that all changes will be set those temperature mix and pressure have been set select okay all Fifty five C twenty eighty mix and thing. All right, that was a good one, though. Do a hundred eleven to eighty nine to everything else, do a whole eight. I don't fucking know. I I don't understand this this puzzle to me is just it's it's lacking something. The next guess is that we need the override key to make the distraction. Well, I don't know where the override key is. That's a big problem. Can't go through this way yet. That would cause the distraction.
the upper level there was a box of cards. I wonder if they can create an override card. I didn't think about going back upstairs. Good point. the quarantine. You're already super tight in that one. Alright, that's why. That's right. We didn't bother with this floor. Box of cards. I'm looking at the box of cards. Box of cards. I don't think I need one of these. Box of blank key cards. Uh, and. So let me pick these up.
the punch monitor to the radio trace feelings. Yeah, same though. I don't think I'm very long for the game at this point. I just I I don't what we have, I don't know what to do. I, I thought I was supposed to just like fuck up the pool and, and I didn't. Can't do anything with that handprint. That blood mark, but nothing. I can't open that toilet. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I think I'm honestly just over it. Save it here. Actually, save. Yeah, that's that's gonna do it for tonight. Sorry, everybody. I'm just like, I feel myself just like slipping away from this. <laughs> Um, and the, the game itself is pretty good. I like, I like the gameplay and everything. I'm just like, my brain is just not there to understand what to do. There's just not enough information for me there. And some of it's been pretty obvious. I get that. But like, I follow the fucking text in the game that says, this is how you make it right. And I did it exactly how it said, and I did everything opposite, except for pressure, because pressure over 15 is just gonna reset everything anyways, so it's like, I don't know. Anyways, let's find somebody to raid. Ah, uh, Scaredy Cat 2's on. Watching something good, I'm sure. Oh no, I think she just finished, actually. Uh, she's probably wrapping up then. Alright. Who else? Uh, got the pyres on. Playing once human with cynical wraith, light caustic, and calibrium. I've never heard of once human. Oh, it looks like a survival game game or something. Is it night night time? Yeah, it is. I'm just kind of meh over there, like the. Where I was in that game, I just was completely losing everything of where I was supposed to be. The puzzles that were spelled out didn't work. Like, I'm like, all right, I'm good. Um, thank you all for being here, though. I do appreciate it. Here's the uh, the raid messages. MMO extract shooters, I'll give. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it looks like one of those. So yeah, if you're a subscriber, you can use that first one. I also pasted it down below in chat. Um, if you're a subscriber, you can use that. It has our emotes in it. Otherwise, you can use uh, the one that has the red pickaxe in it that says raid uh, or any other generic emote that you'd like. Uh, if you'd like to support the stream in a non-monetary way, I would super appreciate a sub or follow over at YouTube, TikTok, um, Twitter, and uh, joining the Discord. Uh, so on YouTube, we post VODs Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Tuesdays and Thursdays, we put up a sh piece of short form content. And if you prefer uh, TikTok over YouTube, you can also check out that same short form content over on TikTok, uh, same time, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Twitter, you all know what it is. 
come join if you'd like. Uh, otherwise, come join us in Discord. It's where the community hangs out um, when we're not streaming. And it's a, become a really cool place to hang out as we approach 200 active users. Wait, who isn't subbed though? Seribot apparently. It's true, I guess. <laughs> yeah. That is, that's all I've got for tonight. So let me go ahead and kick off this raid. To our dearest Gothapire. There we go. Yeah, I apologize, everybody, that my energy level was just not up there tonight. Um, hoping Saturday will go better. Uh, Saturday we'll be back with some Bioshock 2. Um, it'll be fun playing that because we haven't touched it in a couple weeks. So uh, if you're digging the Bioshock stuff, uh, don't go anywhere. Don't go too far. Come see me on Saturday. Yeah, I'll talk to you shortly, Heavy. We get some good rest. Thanks, Shuffle. I appreciate it. I'm definitely going to go chill. Till Saturday. Enjoy your Friday, everybody. Enjoy your Saturday day. And I'll see you all Saturday night. Bye.